Bangladesh is on the app. It is widely recognized as being among the next generation of emerging economies. And while others have stuttered, Bangladesh continues to rise. Bridging India and China, over half of the world's consumers live within 3,000 miles. With a pro-business attitude, the world is taking notice of Bangladesh. Economic zones have played a significant role in where we are today and will continue to be an important element of where we strive to be. Bangladesh's economic zones regime is evolving, harnessing past successes while modernizing its structure to ensure it is well positioned to spur Bangladesh's growth for years to come. Bangladesh started its existing export processing zones regime back in the 1980s. And what Bangladesh has been really successful in doing through the, those export processing zones is not only creating an investor-friendly atmosphere, but also in setting up some very important social and environmental controls. The situation in Bangladesh's export processing zones in terms of labor compliance, environmental compliance, payment of salaries, all of these things is much better than what you oftentimes find outside of the, of the economic zones. In 2010, the government enacted the Economic Zones Act, which is a very forward-thinking and visionary kind of act, which opens up the development of economic zones to the private sector. They've also established an authority to regulate the new economic zone regime, the Bangladesh Economic Zones Authority, uh, and they have drafted a set of rules and regulations to implement the new Economic Zone Act. That's a very positive development. We have streamlined the process even further and one-stop service. Enter, cater if every need for setting up a new business and running it. We follow the best practices of around the globe and ensure international standard working environment within the zones. We have identified five potential location for the economic zones around the country and they are Mirishwarai of Chittagong, Anwara also in Chittagong, Sherpur of Maulu Vibhajar, Shirazgons and Mongla Port of Bagherhat district. So in this visionary shift that Bangladesh is making from government owned and operated zones to private sector owned and operated zones, it's following a trend that we're seeing worldwide and it's a very good trend. It means that Bangladesh is understanding what its investor needs and it's providing for the needs of the investor through these new private sector driven economic zones. Bangladesh is growing. Be a part of it.